Hey Casa de Garcia fam, welcome back to the channel. Let's make some snickerdoodle cookies. Here's the ingredients to my mom's snickerdoodle recipe. One half of a cup of softened butter, a half a cup of shortening, one and a half cups of sugar, two eggs, two and three quarter cups of flour, two teaspoons of cream of tartar, one teaspoon of soda, a quarter teaspoon of salt, two tablespoons of sugar, and two teaspoons of cinnamon. I will also list the ingredients down below. Go ahead and preheat your oven to 400 degrees and let's get started. Okay, we're gonna put a half a cup of butter and then a half a cup of shortening. Some I'm just using some Crisco shortening. Okay, then two eggs, then one and a half cups of sugar. Then we're gonna just mix this up really good and you could use whatever method you want. I'll do it like this, but then I think I'm gonna put my kitchen aid mixer, actually. Just gonna mix that up for So it's nice and creamy and blended together. It looks pretty creamy. So now I'm just gonna you know, take it down the sides a little bit and then give it a little bit more of a mix. Okay, we got two and three quarter cups of flour two tablespoons of cream of tartar, tablespoon of baking powder, and a quarter teaspoon of salt. Okay, and then we're just gonna give that a little bit, with just a little slight mix, and then we're just gonna add that to our wet ingredients. We're just gonna mix that all together. Okay, right. go ahead and we'll start So yeah, you just want to slowly mix in the flour mixture because it will make a mess and it will go all over. So yeah, you just want to slowly put it in there and mix it together a little at a time. And just keep mixing it until it's all combined really well. Okay, I'm just going to clean down the sides a little bit. Okay, now what we're gonna do is just make little balls. You could get like teaspoon sizes if you'd like to, and just make little balls, just like this. And then we're gonna go ahead and mix up that cinnamon and sugar mixture. Just give it a little mix, and that's what we're gonna top the little balls with. Okay, now I have a parchment paper lined cookie sheet, and I'm just gonna place my little cookie ball doughs about an inch apart. Then I'm going to just smash them down with my hand a little bit, just like that. Just do them all and get them all done like that. By this time, also, the oven should be preheated. Then you're going to take that cinnamon and sugar mixture, and you're just going to generously pour some on top, just like that. Put as much as you want, as much or as little as you want. Then we're going to go ahead and stick these in the oven for about 8 to 10 minutes. I did 10 minutes and then immediately you're going to want to go ahead and move those onto a cookie, a cooling rack and just let them cool for about 10 minutes and they will be done. And then this is the final product. Not that cute shape, but very delicious. Use a bigger cookie sheet and spread them apart a little bit more to get a more round cookie. But yeah, this is my mom's recipe that she shared with me. I grew up on these cookies. They're so delicious. If you try them, go ahead and let me know or let me know how you make yours. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't done so yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And I hope you and your family have an amazing rest of your night and God bless.